Welcome to Sage ERP ACPAC version 6.0. In this release, we are improving specific areas in our product that customers have asked us for. The five areas of improvement we'll be highlighting today include the usability of the product with a new user-friendly interface and simplified navigation, allowing users to quickly and easily extract data out of ACPAC by using the new inquiry feature, providing managers with key performance indicators so they can better monitor their business, improved ACPAC integration with Sage CRM so sales reps can efficiently turn quotes into orders, and finally you can now lock down fiscal periods by module. Now let's jump into the product. We will start by logging into the new ACPAC portal. The portal runs in a browser and replaces the ACPAC desktop. Here, I'm logged in as Tom, an accounting manager. This is my customized homepage, which highlights a range of key financial data so that I'm better aware of what's happening in my business. Let's see how much easier it is to navigate using the new interface. For example, let's locate the invoice entry screen. Here, I can use the navigation bar, which is similar to the tree navigation in ACPAC version 5.6, but the information is organized by task type, so it is a lot easier to find what you need. For those screens I use the most, I can also use the shortcut bar. Selecting the invoice entry shortcut opens the screen. As you can see, the new web portal works seamlessly with the existing ACPAC screens. Now, let's have a closer look at the snapshots located in the center of the portal. These snapshots allow me to quickly review business performance metrics. I can configure each snapshot, like changing the date range for my aged receivables. I can also drill down to the underlining information. For example, I can see all of the details for this large amount of current receivables by clicking on the first bar graph, which opens a report. The portal is personalized and only shows the data that the user is allowed to see based on their ACPAC security settings. Each user can personalize their portal, I can add and remove snapshots, minimize them, and move them around. Now let's move on to the ACPAC Inquiry feature. This is a very powerful tool that is also new in version 6.0. It enables users to quickly extract data to help solve operational issues, all without having to run a report. For example, let's picture Tom again, an accounting manager. Let's say Tom wants to view a specific set of posted GL accounts and transactions year-to-date for all control accounts, including details of batch, entry numbers, account numbers, functional and source amounts, and posting dates. As we can see here, Tom can easily add a few filters and select the criteria he wants to search by. After this, he clicks Submit and now has the data ready. To export, he clicks the export button, chooses PDF, and the report is ready to be shared, all in less than two minutes. If Tom wanted to run this query again, he could save it as a public or private inquiry and reuse it. He can also easily modify the layout, something you can't easily do in ACPAC 5.6 unless you are an expert using Crystal Reports. Now let's switch to Sage CRM. Here I'm logged in as a sales rep and want to create a quote for a customer. All I do from the customer summary is click New Quote, and it takes me directly into that screen. As you can see, the quote screen looks like a CRM screen, which is very simple and intuitive to use. Once a quote is created, you can now promote one or more quotes to an order. The order link shows that it is linked to the quote in the screen. The final enhancement ACPAC version 6.0 is to provide the ability to log fiscal periods by module. This is one of the top customer-rated requests. Currently in ACPAC, users cannot lock down specific modules for a given fiscal period, leaving all modules unlocked until everything is completed, which can potentially cause unwanted postings. With the new functionality in 6.0, modules can be easily locked down until everything is completed, preventing any discrepancies. This concludes our overview. We want to thank you for your time and we hope you enjoyed the short overview of what's coming in Sage ERP ACPAC version 6.0.